I was always a part of music, not in like the classical sense. I was part of music, you know, in my church, like my mom sang in the choir. My brother was our drummer. None of them were classically trained. Our exposure to music was like in a sacred space. So when I started in sixth grade, I picked up the trumpet and I was just kind of doing violin and trumpet at the same time. I was also just very interested and very curious about other instruments. So I was like, oh, like my friend played viola, so I asked her to teach me how to play viola. I asked my uh, orchestra director to teach me how to play cello. And so I was just very interested about like all of the instruments. And I think it was that curiosity that's what is fundamental in being a composer. I knew I wanted to attend the Shepherd School at Rice University very at a very early age. Just seeing everything that was here, you know, a great music school inside of a great university. I'm just always curious and why I wanted to be in a place like the Shepherd School in Rice University is the fact that I'm surrounded by people that are also curious. This is probably one of the only places where I can go down the hall and talk to someone that's interested in astrophysics and then also talk to someone that is trying to do stem cell research and someone that's interested in, you know, classics and philosophy and in just having like these very diverse conversations. At the beginning of the year we, you know, we were just getting to know each other and the second conversation we had, I was like, Jalen, like if you need any cellist, like, you know, I'd be happy to play your pieces and then I was like, we have four freshman cellists, you know, the cello besties. So I was like, you should totally compose a cello quartet because everybody loves a good cello quartet. And he didn't say anything when I said that. And then like two or three weeks later, he was like, Claire, I'm writing a cello quartet. I was like, no way. And then he wrote it really fast in like the month of October. It's called Shimmer with an exclamation point, um, and so it's very exciting. It's very movie soundtrack. It it's, evokes like a lot of images, I think. Working with these cellists made the process for me easier writing for a medium where it's the exact same instrument. It's like, oh, how can I write for Claire in a way that, you know, um, best reflects her playing? How can I write for Evan and Sebastian? And so having names and, you know, specific player abilities and how their personality is and how they play made the process of writing Shimmer even more enjoyable, knowing the performers, knowing the personalities, knowing what they enjoy doing, um, just made it even more fun and more personable. They were truly the real inspiration. Their enthusiasm and just their joy in wanting to create something with me and something, you know, just, I don't know, it's very emblematic of our of our friendship and our camaraderie. And the piece is really great. I didn't expect a freshman composer to be this talented, but he is. It just became this big thing and it was, um, it's been a fun ride to be a part of. There was a, a couple weeks ago we had a coaching with my teacher um, on the piece and it was sort of like all my favorite people were like in one room together um, playing music so I feel like our relationship is like really great but playing the piece it's it's so cool to play good music with like your good friends. Mm -hmm. 